So we are talking about how to use homeopathy. It's really very simple. I recommend you grab a little notebook, um, depending upon the type of Materia Medica. If you have something like Homeopathy for Mommy's book, there is note section in the back and you can make notes for each of your family members. Um, so when something happens, they fell and they bumped their head, uh, you can put that they bumped their head, they vomited, they whatever, write those down. I gave remedy X, Y, or Z three times I saw improvement I, I gave this remedy saw very little improvement moved to this remedy and you know it worked um, when you're giving a remedy a lot of times they are pellets so you're gonna succuss it you're going to take and open the bottle remember not to be around strong odors put a couple of pellets into the lid one is fine two if it's in there is fine you don't need a whole lid full uh, place it under the tongue you're gonna wait five minutes um, or five minutes. You're gonna wait 15 minutes, give another dose, wait uh, wait 15 more minutes, and give a third dose. So that's three total. You give your initial, wait 15, give your second, wait 15, give your third. Um, when you are choosing the remedy, you're gonna be looking at things that, like what happened to them physically, what is going on emotionally, and um, when you read through the description of the remedy, which one best suits them. So you might find that there are 30 different remedies for a cough, but if that cough is wet, or if that cough is dry, or if that cough produces phlegm, or if it's just a tickling cough, all of those things play into which remedy you're going to choose. So it's no different than um, going to the doctor and them telling you they have 20 different prescriptions they can give you for what you came in for. And sometimes they'll give you that prescription, you'll realize it didn't work for you and they're just gonna try another one. Um, the problem is when you have a prescription, it comes with side effects. Uh, when you have a remedy, there's no side effects. So you can very easily switch from this initial remedy that you thought was the one that they needed and maybe it didn't do anything, move on to that second one that you thought, oh, this one might be it, but um, you weren't sure. So never be afraid to go on and move to the next remedy if you're not seeing improvement after three doses, but it's super simple, super important to try to keep those notes so that you know what worked really well because a lot of times when you watch, um, as I've been doing homeopathy, using homeopathy for the last 12 years, you notice that there's patterns. Uh, certain remedies work really well for certain people, and once you know that and can remember that, and if you have a lot of kids like I do, nine kids, um, sometimes you forget which remedy you gave to which child. So it is nice to keep notes, whether it's a separate notebook or in the notes section or sticky notes. Sticky notes do fall off though, so I do recommend a little something more permanent. So there you have it, super simple, not scary. Don't worry, um, there's not the side effects you have with other things. Just grab your remedy, give that remedy, and watch it work. You will be impressed, amazed. I love that. <laughs>